everyone and welcome back to my channel my name is India and today I've got an unboxing and I'm super excited for it they told me I had to get rid of stuff if I wanted to get more stuff so I did so I did they're gonna hold me back from what I want but I did buy this with my own money and if you would like to buy one there is a link down below in the description box but what is it that I bought you want to know it's in this box so let's open it do I have any band geeks out there? I was in the band for a long time. <laughs> this should just be my order invoice. So, guys, this won't take very long because it's going to be a short unboxing. But I bought a new camera bag. Sorry, not sorry. This time, though, I bought another one from Gata Bag. Um, if you follow me on social media or you've seen my blog posts or you've seen my unboxing of my other Gata Bag and other vlogs and stuff, I have been using my Gata backpack a lot. Like I use it a lot and I love it. It is fantastic. Um, so, but I was ready for a purse, okay? I was ready for a purse and I really wanted, I wasn't seeing enough videos about this purse and what it fits in it, okay? So here it is, here's the purse. And it's a lot bigger than what I thought. It's wide and that's what made me finally get it because I started noticing in some pictures when it was turned to the side how wide it was, you know? And so, I mean, because it always, you know, says if it's this certain camera and this certain camera, but, you know, if you don't have that type of camera, it's sometimes hard to realize what size it is, right? So, I bought the Lola, the Lola, the Lola Noir. Um, I think it's really cute. I wanted a black camera bag. I wanted a black bag because all of my other bags are some sort of brown or yellow or brown sort of aesthetic and sometimes I want to go black uh, you know I just want to go black and so this was the right time for me to do that. I mean if anybody wants to gift me the tan version go for it. Go for it. And so because I will rock that too. Sorry, I'm just taking all the, I guess I'll show you what it came in. Taking all the plastic off. Because it's, it's packaged very nicely. <laughs> I'm really excited. But it, it does have a nice bag sleeve for people who like to keep their purses in their dust jackets. I don't. <laughs> I don't at all. And then here is the actual bag. We're gonna take off some of this. And this, and this little insert. There we go. So, getting started on the outside of this bag. So you guys already know the first thing I do like about this bag is the size. It's not too big, but it probably will, it will fit, um, my Olympus, the one I'm recording on, is my Olympus OMD um, M E M One Mark Two. <laughs> their names are complicated, okay? But I'm filming on their E M One Mark Two, um, so that is, and I, and that's the one I now I use mainly for pictures. Um, I don't use this one for vlogging or on the go because it's heavy, um, and it's cropped, so I have to be really careful about where I'm at. Um, but it'll fit, I think it'll fit perfect in here for pictures. I don't have anything that size anymore to put in here and compare right now. Um, it's got a crossbody strap in here. So far, the only thing that I notice right now that is just a personal preference for me, I like zippers across the top. I like things that keep my bag closed across the top and not just, just this magnetic flap. Because right now, this bag is really easy to pickpocket from. Like, 
super, super easy to pickpocket from. Like, this isn't going to keep anybody out. Like, your stuff's going to get stolen in this. Sorry, it's true. So, if you are in a place, a crowded place, where you think your stuff's going to get stolen, keep it in front of you and keep a hand on it at all times. That's what I would do. Just swing it in front, put a hand on it. Um, but this time, unlike in the backpack, this one did come, sorry, it's got a, I've got a lot of packaging. <laughs> this one did come with their, with a divider. Um, they do sell extra dividers online. Um, online, so that way you can, what goes with their peach interior, their peach interior. And then they've just got this quick slip pocket right here. So, sorry, I'm trying to open everything. <laughs> but I mean, that's basically the bag. Um, I think it will fit what I want it to fit. It'll fit my phone, my wallet, um, the camera, obviously. Um, a small, it'll fit a small, if you have a small wallet, then I think you can also fit an extra lens in here. I could definitely fit another lens in here if I needed to. Um, it'll fit smaller cameras just fine. So like this is the Canon EOS M6, super small, super great, super fantastic. I do vlog with this one. And we can slide that right on in here. I can slide it on its side. I can slide it straight down. And it's super deep in there. I hope I don't drop it out of here. Look at that. It's super deep in there. Like there's like a good two inches of space above it. And I think it's actually extended. So I'm going to. So yeah, it's super deep in there. And this one has a lot more extra space. In there I think this one is gonna fit um, nice and snug in there and then on the other side I'll have room for another battery my wallet in a like a, a lens wipe or some sort of you know wipe in here as well as like I can put lipstick and chapstick here and some gum um, so I will say this bag is for the minimalist photographer um, it doesn't have a lot of pockets it doesn't have it doesn't have a back side like zipper pocket in here um, so it's definitely for the minimalist photographer it's for if you're going to lunch with your friends or something like that and you guys know that you want to take pictures of your food take pictures of each other but it's not for like I'm going out today and I need to go on a shoot probably great for um, traveling or for sightseeing photography, things like that. Things where you're not trying to do like a whole bunch of stuff, whole bunch of lens changes, all of that. Um, it's definitely gonna be great for that, in my opinion. I guess I just got this bag, so I don't know. But I'm saying in terms of what it seems like this bag can hold, it's not that much. Um, it's got a nice little shoulder pad here, and it feels comfy. We'll clip these on. We'll clip these on and then yeah you've got your nice little bag I chose the one with the tassel because I couldn't tell what the difference was between this one and the one with the with the twisty clip on it I tried to ask on Instagram but it's probably like the one time they didn't reply because they're actually really good with replying on Instagram um, but it's super cute like I said it's not meant to go someplace or I wouldn't take it someplace where you think you might get pickpocketed just because there's absolutely no security on this bag. Like, not one bit. Not a snap, not a zipper. There's nothing on this bag that'll keep any of your stuff remotely secure. Um, it is padded a little bit. Um, it's mostly, oh, actually I wouldn't say it's padded. It's got felt lining to keep everything soft. Um, but yeah, yeah. So it's probably not, it's not as heavy duty as a Kelly Moore bag. It's not as heavy duty as a Kelly Moore bag in terms of padding and keeping your equipment safe. Um, and in terms of having a lot of pockets, a lot of places to put things. It's definitely not that. It's definitely a purse that they put a felt lining in and a divider in for your camera gear. So I will say that. But it is super cute and I will bring it on vacation with me because I needed a bag like this. And I have a obsession with bags. 
Um, but yeah, so that's it. There's not a bag on the back. There's not a pocket on the back. Um, so yeah. So that is it. Um, if you want to check out my unboxing of the backpack, um, I will leave that linked down below. Like I said, I do love that one. Um, I use it a lot use it a lot it's got a zipper and a snap it's got a back pocket it's got an inside pocket so I'm kind of surprised about this one with like the lack of zipped things zipped ways it works um that's okay it's okay I'm gonna make it work I'm gonna make it work for me um I think it's great for going out with friends for brunch and things like that um but yeah so comment below and let me know what you think of this bag down below um let me know if there are any other camera bags out there that you really like i love hearing about new camera bags um i also have a full video of kelly moore bags and bags that i love there um but yeah follow me on social media and on my blog because that's where you'll see me how i use this bag what i put it all in it and yeah so un oh i already said it no i said it follow my social media follow my blog um but yeah that is it for me so until next time, keep turning the pages.